Hello aspirants, welcome to Activision for you. In this video, we would be talking about the much awaited notification for CFTRI 2025. As you know, CFTRI, that is the Central Food Technological Research Institute, is one of the most prominent and important institutes when we talk about food technology in India. It came into existence in 1950 with a great vision of inspiring the young minds and scientists to pursue in-depth research and development in the food science and technology department. CFTRI offers its two years program for MSc, that is MSc in food technology. Going straight to the notification, the total number of seats this year are 36. Till the last year, the total number of seats were 34 as such. So there are two more seats that have been increased for foreign candidates. So 30 are for all across India. Two seats are reserved for defense personnel, two are for industry-sponsored candidates, and two are for foreign candidates. This two seats for the foreign candidates has been recently added in CFTRI 2025. Talking about the most important dates, the online application forms have already been started from 13th of May. The last date to submit the online application form is 23rd of June. The entrance exam, the most important thing over here is the entrance exam is scheduled for 13th of July 2025. Now looking forward to the eligibility criteria. So for admission into CFTRI MSc Food Technology, a candidate should have a bachelor's degree, which can be either in science, agriculture, engineering, technology, or any other domain with a minimum of 55% of marks. If the person belongs to general EWS, OBC can uh, OBC categories or if it is a defense personnel and 50% for SC, ST, PWD candidates. For industry sponsored candidates, bachelor's degree in science, agriculture, engineering, technology is required with 55% of marks and at least of two years of industrial experience should be there in any of the food or allied industries mandatory. Also, if you want to be an industry sponsored candidate, then you have to submit an authenticate certificate of sponsorship from the sponsor industry. For defense personnel, candidates presently serving and nominated by the Ministry of Defense will be considered. For foreign candidates, two seats for the foreign nationals who are interested in joining the MSc Food Technology course. Eligibility criteria is again bachelor's degree in science, agriculture, engineering or technology with English as the language of instruction. And the minimum marks for them is 60%. Now talking about the course fee for regular candidates, it is 31,000 per semester. Industry sponsored candidates, it is 62,000 per semester. Defense personnel, it is 62,000 per semester. And for foreign candidates, it is dollar one fifteen hundred, $1,500, $1,500. For admissions into CFTRA, MSc Food Technology Program, there are some reservation of seats by ACSIR that are uh, for OBC category, OBC candidates belonging to non creamy layer. The criteria of non creamy layer will be as per the notification of Government of India. If you belong to the non creamy layer, then you are eligible for the reserved seats. Candidates belonging to OBC category but coming under creamy layer are not entitled for relaxation or reservation available to the OBC category. Now, talking here about the exam pattern and the examination centers. So, as you all know, overall for CFTRA, there are 100 questions that are being asked. 100 minutes are given for you to solve the question. That is one minute per question is given. And uh, plus one mark would be provided to you for every positive response and minus 0.25 would be deducted for every negative response. All the questions would be MCQs, that is multiple choice questions. And the... Uh, Centers over here are Mysore, Guwahati, Ghazibad, Tiruvananthapuram, Pune, Hyderabad, Kolkata and Bangalore. So these are the centers that you can select out of which you can select any of the three options. Most important things over here is what are the documents that is to be uploaded. So if you see for the documents, one is your one recent passport site size colored photograph the candidate signature all semester marks or grade cards of qualifying exam. If you have not uh, you have, if you have not got your degree or if you have not got your semester mark sheets for your final semester, then you can upload the semester marks of all the semesters till your sixth or maybe seventh or whatever your pre-final semester be. 
proof of date or date of uh, date of birth that that can be a birth certificate aadhar card 10th class mark sheet or any others certificate for the claim of reservation like if you belong to obc non creamy layer sc or st categories then you should have the category certificate for the same parent or guardian's latest income tax return filed or income proof should also be given proof for remittance of application fee through sbi collect that is the application fee whatever you have processed you should have a screenshot or the e receipt for the same that you have to upload experience or and sponsor certificates for the industry candidates nomination and sponsor certificate for defense candidates and nationality proof for the foreign candidates so this is all about the notification that they have given in cftra 2025 but one of the most important things over here is as you've already see, already seen that there are some differences in the cftra notification this year uh, as for the number of seats they have been increased by plus 2 and if we talk about the syllabus you can see a tremendous change in the syllabus for the entrance exam of msc food technology by cftra just last two months are left and you got a lot of changes in the syllabus as you can see we have highlighted what all things have been added new in the syllabus food biotechnology has entirely been eliminated rather than that core biotechnology is being given nutrition has been added as such dairy science many of the new topics have been added food engineering a lot of new topics have been added mental ability and general awareness are similar to what they have been asking in the previous years but with all these changes at the last moment of your preparation uh, here comes agrivision for you we are here to support you with your study plan mm -hmm. and uh, for that you can join up the cftra crash course by agrivision for you it is live now and you can join up and we would be covering all these things all the syllabus in detail in our crash course for for more information about the crash course and the details about cftra application form you can always contact us on the number given on screen or you can mail us and we will be happy to help you out thank you that's all for this video